What's up? Welcome. Today we are... Today we are... Today we are... Ah! Fine. I'll listen to it. The Somebody Tyrant and... Sinistia. The Poetic Era featuring Ben Dur. I'll listen to it. I I'm clicking on it right now. I I'll do it. I'll do it. You've been asking for like three weeks now, so I, I cannot ignore it anymore. I, I can't. So we're doing it today. You told me this is the best deathcore like ever. So I'm gonna I'm gonna judge it on the highest degree, okay? You told me it's the best shit out there. I'm gonna treat it as the best shit out there. This is the Symbody Tyrants. Sinistia. The Poetic Era featuring Vendor. Let's do this. Big opening. Snowy forest. Bit of a symphony. Okay, I see you. Please go somewhere. <laughs> That's a bit insane. This is a bit crazy. It's like a classical piece. Okay, finally we are picking up. Love it. Gritty. Gritty production. And we're back to it. Jesus. <laughs> that was the second interesting part. Wrath. It's a very thoughtfully crafted piece so far. Gotta respect it. A modulation. Again. Destroy that double base. Ooh. I found the groove. Yep. 
epic, an epic resolution, maybe? Ash? It's gotta be. Okay, okay. I see it. I see it now. The heaviness. It's everlasting, never ending. The poetic era. Sinistia. Featuring Bandur. There you go. I did it. Are you happy now? <laughs> I mean, this is definitely up there with some of the heaviest shit I've heard this year. It is uh, very, very disgusting, very big, very heavy. I will say that um, in my first listen, there were about three to four plus that breakdown at the end parts uh that were actually kind of interesting to me the rest blended together a little bit but that's an issue i find with basically all songs of this particular style of deathcore this like symphonic extreme deathcore and it, it just all sounds to me a little bit samey i don't know if it's just me or if it's just you um i i'm not crazy about this song I mean, of course, it has a disgusting breakdown at the end, and it has a, a pretty nice production, if I do say so myself. It's very... It's the production it has that kind of gritty, almost clipping sound. I, I really like that because it, it translates that whole, like, larger-than-life heaviness that they're trying to portray here. But I don't know. Like, the, the structure of the song itself didn't really have me engaged all the way. There were parts where it breaks and it drops, and it, and it gets me actually interested, and the rest is just either blast beats or just... And it's like, yeah, I guess it's impressive, uh, but it's not that impressive to me. <laughs> also, personally, I expected a little bit more out of vocals. Uh, there was no point during the song where I was like, oh my god, this is some crazy shit I've never heard before. Like, the vocals are, are good. Don't get me wrong. The vocals are good. I could never do what they're doing. But, um, again, I, it wasn't something that I, I would call a highlight of the song for me. It, it just kind of blended with the rest of the instrumental. Um, that didn't really catch me that well, I'll be quite honest with you. But once again, it's pretty cool seeing two bands coming together, it's Disembodied Tyrant and Sinistia, uh, to make a song together. I think that's a really awesome thing, it's not something I've, I've seen or heard before uh, that many times in any genre, to be quite honest. Uh, it's not really a feature, it's kind of more, we made a song together, here it is. So that's really cool, I think that's really cool. I would never listen to this again. It's not my thing. I, I'm not into this type of deathcore. Uh, but you asked for my opinion, and I give it to you. It's nice, but it's not for me. I think my favorite part of this whole song would be that section in the closer to the beginning, where it actually sounds like a classic, um, classical musical piece. That sounded to me like some Vivaldi, Beethoven shit, and it, and it kind of fit this song pretty great because it's already kind of symphonic. Uh, I really love that part. That was that was actually kind of creative and exciting. So. I uh, gotta give uh, its due. But yeah, that's all I think about this track by Disembodied Tyrant and Sinistia. Uh, the Poetic Era featuring Bandor. Let me know what you think about this track down in the comments below. I would love to hear your thoughts as well as uh, your thoughts on my opinion. <laughs> Am I wrong? Am I wrong in my assessment? I just I wasn't really into it, that's all. But hey, if you want to check out more of my stuff, check out all the links in the description. I have a bunch of new channels now, so check them out. I also have, of course, my Twitch, where I stream every Saturday around 3 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, as well as my Patreon, where you can find a whole bunch of exclusive stuff like album reactions. And of course, subscribe to the channel. I'm here every single day, so come back tomorrow. Maybe there they're going to be a better video, but um, that's all for me. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.